<laughs> we visited with a wonderful nonprofit organization this week called Working Wardrobes, but the name falls short of describing what they do to provide thousands of people each year, helping them to get back on their feet. Now, in its 20th year, Working Wardrobes reaches out to a wide variety of people in need. Clients range from those wanting to transition from welfare to work to those recovering from catastrophic illnesses. CEO and founder Jerry Rosen says it's not only important that a client just dress for success. So clients go through career assessments, they go through a time with a job developer, they have access to our library and our archives of all kinds of information, and this is so important because the career development services are available ongoing for our clients. So we want to make sure that our clients are as confident on the inside as they look on the outside. But there's no doubt that your outward appearance can make a big difference in how you feel about yourself and your confidence in your ability. As you can see in these before and after shots, clothes can indeed make the man or woman. Clients are also given tips in makeup and grooming. Danielle sums up the message that she and others took away from the course. That we were bold, bright, beautiful women, and we could succeed at anything if we put our mind to it. Working Wardrobes has partnerships with 70 different uh, social service agencies all over Southern California. In their 20 years, they've helped over 50,000 people re-enter the workforce and achieve self-sufficiency. Quite a group. What a great program. It Isn't really it? is. You know, such a great way to clean out your closet and then also give back to the community. And you can go to workingwardrobes.org and you can find out about giving yeah. your stuff. Excellent. And most of us volunteers, they're down there to help. It's wonderful. Great. Great. Love it. Thank you. Thanks, Thank Sam. you.